हेलो एवरी वन आई होप यू आर प्रिपेयरिंग वेल फॉर द एग्जामिनेशन सो द प्रिलिम्स एग्जाम इज़ ओवर एंड ओनली वन प्रिलिम्स एग्जाम इज़ लेफ्ट लाइक फॉर आई बी पी एस पी ओ ओनली वन डेट एग्जाम इज़ लेफ्ट एंड दिस वीडियो इज़ फॉर मेन्स बिकॉज मैनी पीपल विल फोकस ऑन मेन्स फ्रॉम नाउ ऑन एंड द अदर कैंडिडेट्स हु हैव नॉट परफॉर्म्ड वेल इन आई बी पी एस पी ओ प्रिलिम्स देन आई सजेस्ट यू टू फोकस ऑन प्रे एज वेल एज मेन्स फ्रॉम नाउ ऑन बिकॉज टू मेजर एग्जामिनेशंस आर ऑल्सो लेफ्ट all right so do not lose your heart and keep preparing and keep giving your 100% for the upcoming exams in this video i am going to share my strategy and how i used to select questions in mains examination all right and there is a sale going on on smart keda mock test in which they are providing 25% discount on their mock test for diwali sale and smart keda mock test brings you the exact level as the mains examination as nowadays the exams are quite tricky and they are providing the same level questions in their mock test and people will say that they have high level mocks but it is not like that because sometimes the paper is tricky and at that time you feel pressure that how i can how i will manage it and for this situation smart keda prepares you beforehand all right so please attempt the mocks seriously and do the analysis very well and the link of smart keda mock test is given in description and this offer is valid for for today and tomorrow only so this is a big discount 25% okay and use this code fast22 by this you will get the discount so first of all the question uh, for question selection what matters you know when mains examination opens then you see that sometimes there are very difficult questions at the starting okay like the first section if the first section is quant then the first question will be very difficult and you will see that okay i can't do it and you know this thing will start pressurizing your mind because you have seen that first question is difficult now your mind will say to you that it is difficult and the whole paper is going to be difficult so this is what happens this is what usually happens and it has also like i have also been through this so what you have to do you have to use skip button as a tool all right if the first question is difficult do not think that much about it and just skip it all right and just take a overview of that subject which is open all right and just keep skipping if you find like any question which is like a 20% tricky then skip it and try to find the most simple question because if you are able to attempt at least 8 to 9 simple questions then it will increase your confidence and then you will attempt the trickier questions also okay so try to find 8 to 9 questions which you are doable and sometimes it happens that in quants like two or three questions are only doable and others are very difficult so you think that i i can't do this but this is not like that because sometimes quant is very very difficult in sbi pu last year the people who took selection many were there like who have not attempted a single question in quant section okay i am talking about 2020 2020 year so this is also this is this also happens so please try to be prepared that yes the exam is going to be tough but i will use this strategy all right so first you will find the simple questions and then you will move to the trickier ones and for question selection like for learning how to select the questions i suggest to you that you practice it from the main mocks and how you will practice i will discuss that from main mock for what you should do in quants and in reasoning daily select 10 to 12 questions from quant and 10 to 12 questions from reasoning all right like before sleeping like the in the before day try to select 10 to 12 doable questions which you think that yes i can do it and if not if i see the solution then maybe i will understand okay so try to select 10 to 12 questions in both the subjects and write the question number like if the question number is 75 then write 75 78 80 so write like this the question number in your to do list and the next day try to solve those questions because you know if you keep solving the doable questions they will give you confidence and at first you will find very less questions like in the whole mock test you will find like in the whole mock test of quant you will find 
find around five to six doable questions only. But by time, if you will keep practicing. then this number will increase all right and i am not saying like you have to do only 10 to 12 questions and you have to leave all the questions no these are the doable questions now there are some questions who will be a little tricky okay not that much but they will be a little tricky so try to understand them by seeing their solution okay and if you are able to understand the concept then it is very good you can now for the next time when you will select questions from the next mock test you will also select the questions which were which are little tricky because you know how to solve those questions so this thing will increase your confidence and your question selection pattern will also improve because in mains question selection plays an important role okay so you will also learn these tricky questions and now your your questions will increase like your doable questions will increase from 15 to 6 to 15 to 16 so this is the method okay and now there will be some questions which are like which you are not able to do and like these are the questions very very tough which are so for those questions if you are not able to understand them by watching the solution also then you can just skip them because in mains we do not attempt 100 out of 100 questions or 200 out of 200 no we only attempt the questions in which we are confident and we have to just clear the mains okay and there are like the mains cut off is around 55 to 60% so it means that mains exam is tough and we do not have to solve the whole paper we just have to attempt the doable questions and we have to be above average and if you are above average in attempting mains paper then you will finally be selected so you have to keep this thing in your mind okay and do the question selection and if you find other questions very very tricky then you can just leave them because you should invest your energy here this is the area which can increase your marks and not the ones like not the 3 to 4 other difficult questions which are not doable you have done everything you have asked someone or you have watched the solution and you have googled it every everything but you are not able to understand then just leave them and this is the strategy okay please try to write the question number before sleeping in your to do list and next day please try to invest your energy and for means mock, mock test attempt i will suggest to attempt one mock per week at this time okay you can take sunday monday the day of your choice and please try to attempt one mains mock test but like i didn't attempt any mains mock test i just used to select the questions by this strategy before sleeping okay and i just used to solve the questions next day and nothing else so if you want that you want exam like atmosphere and in the time boundation you want to attempt the mains paper then it is all right but the, for the people who want to learn how to select the questions and who want to increase their confidence in mains they can just select the questions and they can practice so this is the way how to select questions and if you want i will open a mock test for you and i will show you how i have i select the questions so please try to write in comment section if you want me to do that and that is all for this video thank you and have a nice day